I want to switch gears a little bit and get into angioplasties and surgeries for PAD. And we actually have a photo here uh, of an angioplasty, a balloon angioplasty. If you can tell us what we're looking at, doctor. Well, basically, uh, when, when we discussed that there's a blockage in the artery, and wherever that artery is going and the blood flow is not reaching it, well, you're gonna have a problem, be it in a leg, you may develop an ulceration or gangrene, be it in the heart, you might develop angina, and subsequently you could have a myocardial infarct, or be it in an artery that goes to the brain, specifically the carotid artery. Well, the lack of blood flow and the shedding of particles from that plaque into the brain can produce a stroke. So classically, we've always dealt with by doing what was called a bypass, which we sometimes need to do them much less common than before. In other words, it's like placing a new artery around the place of blockage. Right. But now this is most common, the balloon angioplasty. Now what we're doing is commonly we can actually change the whole discipline of what we're doing, and that's, this is not new. It's been ongoing now for more than 20 years uh, in that we actually go inside the blood vessel and navigate to anywhere in the body to, f to the point where there's a, a blockage so that's impeding the blood flow to go wherever it's supposed to go, taking blood with oxygen, food, and all the good things. And we're able to traverse, as you see on the first image, a catheter that's passing through the blockage. On the second imaging, you're seeing how that balloon gets expanded and then once you retrieve all that out, you see that you've increased the diameter and widened the area of what was blocked before. And now the blood cells are happily going downstream and also K. Okay. Sometimes with the angioplasty to avoid the recoiling of that plaque to come back down, a, a stent is placed right. and then it helps to maintain the patency and the recoil to come back in. And basically you're, your end point is the same. You're facilitating blood flow through an area of blockage mm -hmm. to where the blood is necessary.